What's up everyone, Kate here from MB Tennis. Hope you guys are doing great today. Today we're gonna to be working on some serve plus one. Now this is very important. First touches are so important and to be able to hold your service games, first touches, especially on the serve, are important. And you don't need to have a bomb of a serve to hold your service games, although it helps. If you look at guys that have great serves in the past, such as Roger Federer, he has a great serve plus one. So not only is he hitting his spots, but his serve plus one is very good. He was able to hold 88.9% of his service games while he was on tour. So the drill we're gonna be doing here today is we're gonna serve out a game and you need to be able to hit your spot. So you need to come up with the spot you wanna hit. So let's say you wanna serve wide and go to the open court. You need to come up with that in order to get one point. So you're gonna serve out a game. That would be 15 love. Let's say you make the serve and you miss your plus one shot then you're going to be down love 15. So it can create a little bit of a pressure-like scenario, which is very important for players that want to put themselves in that situation to help them get ready for tournament, practice matches, etc. So let's jump into it. Let's change it up. Instead of going slice serve wide, we'll go kick serve wide. Could serve to mess with the opponent when they think a slice is coming out wide. There we go, baby. It's more like it. We're back here, got to activate the feet a little bit. Sometimes when people go for the plus one, they sit. They sit a little bit and they wait and their feet freeze up. So it's important to keep your feet moving as well. So here we go. We're at 15 love, kicks are about wide, open court right here. I miss, but that's not a bad miss, really, because I did make the ball. I did come into the court, so I would have taken time away from my opponent, but not where I wanted, I guess, so I still lose that point. So it's 15 all. We're gonna go flat serve T, and then to the open court, actually, we change it up. Have a ball. Didn't bring two balls with me to the line that time. Rookie mistake. Always bring two balls to the line with you folks. You guys know that, though. Okay, T, then back behind them. So that's another thing too when you guys are doing this drill you got to make sure you're hitting four hands every time because that's how you're going to win points on your plus one you're not going to win points hitting your backhand I hate to break it to you guys so try and push yourself to hit your forehand 30 15 all right here we go slice t back to where coach chris is That's the other thing too, kind of play with the spin a little bit in height, you can. Although you do want to be aggressive on your serve plus one. That one wasn't as fast, had a little bit more spin on it. Have a little bit more high percentage when you guys can do that. So 40-15. Okay. All right, let's get that nice wide serve here. Nice slice wide, open court. Here we go. Oh yeah. Ah! Oh! I had it, I was all over it, but see you guys, I was talking about footwork earlier. I stayed flat footed there. See how I kind of like, I'm sure if you guys go back, I kind of went like this. I didn't move through the ball like I should have there. So 40, 30, we gotta close it out, let's go. We want it right here. Kick serve out wide to the open court. Try again, second serve here. Oh my god, I missed it. Oh, it's very frustrating when you're up 40-15 and you cannot close it. Whether you're doing a drill or a match. But this is what this drill is for. Because my season is in a couple months, so... Got to practice. It is deuce. Here we go. I'm going with the kick serve wide again. And then to the open court. There we go, folks. Another deuce game. I don't like that, but we made it work. Um, there you guys have it. It wasn't pretty today, but this is definitely a good drill to make you feel uncomfortable. You know, if you want to dumb it down for yourself, you can just make it so the plus one is in the glue or in the court. 
um, and then you can kind of make progressions. So what we had, like you guys saw, was I had to make the serve where I was calling it to go, but then also I needed to go in the zone that I was calling. So you guys can kind of play with that, but that's going to be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. You're really seeing what my practice is like. Don't forget to like and subscribe on the way to 10,000 subs. Let's do it. See you guys in the next one. Need the serve. Bottom of the net. That's not good. I missed my first serve, so now I gotta go for a second serve. I'll try and do the same thing since I want to get that pattern. Oh, I double fault. So love 15. Not exactly what I wanted to show you guys at the first one. Wide and then open court. Okay, so I missed in the net. Got a little excited there. So. I made it. And I missed. I gotta get inside the cone, so I actually missed it, so I'm down 40 love. So low 40. Not my best showing right now, but I gotta go wide here again and then to the open court. Struggling right now.